discovered by a famous fighter. Mr. Sin Wu in the Qi Dynasty divided the weapons as follows. The spear, the plate, the whip, the hammer, the chain, baton, ring, rope, knife, the spear, the sword, the broadsword, the halberd, the axe, the double axe, the bow, the staff, the scythe. Also, he nominated the javelin as the best weapon to use. Especially when aimed directly at the throat. Er... Uh, Master, any more? Oh. Mm. There's the sword, of course. People say that a trusty sword wards off evil spirits. The Seven Star Sword and the Long Chun Sword, used to assassinate the king. Ah. And two fingers, three fingers. The hawk turns into a tiger. The Silken Rope, or how Chang Chin took a wife for himself. Master, it's very exciting. Can you tell us some more? Right. The staff's a killing weapon for attack and defense. Now, the staff can be lethal in attack. Beauty defies the devil. Reaching for the sky, striking. Hitting below the belt, striking to the root. All right, children, the deadly strike. Two dragons supporting the pillar. Now, during the war, the 18 weapons slowly fell into disuse. So that by the end of the Qing Dynasty, the only men who knew how to use them all were Ye Shang Han, but he was killed in a bloody fight, and his brother Ye Chu Mao, who disappeared. And so the people lost touch with the art of using the 18 women. Thank <laughs> you.
I was told that I could find you here. What's the letter? I got nothing. I don't have it. You're lying. Of a bear's paw. If we could get hold of one, uh, we'll be rich. <laughs> right. I like bear's paw. You eat bear. Yeah. Huh? Huh? You eat the bear. Hey, the bear's coming. The bear's coming. <laughs> we'll make it this time. Put me down, would you? Quick, put me down! Come on! Oh, oh you fool! If I put you down, the bear will get away! But what about me? Let me down right now! I can't take it anymore! Well, you shut your mouth! What are you shushing out for? Shush your face! I'll let you down! Pull it! Come on! Come on! Oh. Uh, 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 quickly! Uh, uh, help! Uh, help! Quick, round the tree! Get the rope! Uh, uh, go on! Uh, go on, quickly! Uh, 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 oh, we got it! We did it! That's right! Shut up! Come on! Oh, come on, oh, we got him! Put me down! Put me down! I'm a man, not a bear! It's a man! It's not a bear! Get me out of here! Oh, you get the gutters! Get me out of here! Put me down! We lost our bear! We got no money! Put me down, you bastard! Oh, kill us! Oh, my God! Get me out of here! Let's go! Get me out of here! Put me down! Get me out of here! Don't run away! Come back! Put me down! Come
you going? Vajra, what's it to you? I know you're the one who killed my two brothers. You're now going to pay for their deaths. Wasn't me. I never did it. Hand over the letter. Why should I? Because our master, Lu Yan Lung's looking for Yer Chu Mao. What if I don't? If you don't, as long as you keep it, you'll be in danger. <laughs> I'm afraid you are in danger. <laughs> if you want to play games with me, you've asked for it. <laughs> <laughs> Say your prayers. And even though I win, I'm not happy about it. I don't know why the other fighters stop me just for one letter. And why do they all want to kill me? It's lovely weather for fishing, but the fish aren't for market. Unless they can buy me some wine. You can row the boat ashore. <coughs> <laughs> Look, there are hundreds of them. <laughs> Grandpa! Grandpa! I'm going to fetch Brother Lee. I will come down. Grandpa! Off you go. Bye-bye. Grandpa, do you know where she's going? She's gone to fetch Brother Lee. Oh, who's Brother Lee? She's the one I mentioned to you. Uncle Lee's grandson. That Brother Lee? Why is she coming here? He wants to learn Kung Fu. What kind of Kung Fu? Uh, the 18 weapons training. Oh, Oh, you're a kid. I'll teach you when you grow up. I want to learn now. The sun's going down, and they still haven't come back yet. I hope they're not in any trouble. Whenever it takes, we got to get that letter. I don't care how many men die. Hmm. Right. I better be going. Huh. We must see the master's orders carried out. What is this for? Mr. Kershi Shen. The master told me to visit you. Oh, but what can I do for you? Why is Master Lu so kind to me? If you'd be so good to tell me what I can do. Oh, there's no need. 
Uh, though you would say it's nothing, I know very well what it is you want. <laughs> My master had told me, you're bound to understand. You know everything. There are no flies on you either. Huh? Uh, <laughs> I gotta go. Uh, Brother Kerr? Mm. Hey. Uh, Brother Kerr, how can I contact you? Oh, my master's departing from Wai Chung. He's going to Tung Ching City. But where exactly? You'll soon find out. Uh, I will. <laughs> master, who is that man? Student of Lu Yan Lung. Mister, you're welcome. <laughs> Mister, what would you like to eat? Uh, I'm just resting. I don't want a thing. Just some tea. Uh, only some tea. So what? Can't I? Uh, of course, sir. Do you think that guy's the one we're after? Uh, maybe. Go and check him out. What? <laughs> Mister, what's your name? Where are you from? Where are you going? How come you're so interested in me? Are you trying to find me a wife? <laughs> Mister, excuse me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. See the one? I reckon so. Watch him. Mister, where are you going? I want to stay a while. Uh, I'm the housekeeper, Chan Han Chug. My master ordered me to come and welcome you. Thank you. <laughs> Please. Mr. Chen, huh? does anyone know I'm coming? Master well, Toby, that I'm the only one that knows you're coming. Nobody else does. Good. Who's over there? Huh? It's me. Who is it? Oh, it's Mr. Chu. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Lu, you already know it's me. Good night. Right. Nobody knows I have come here, except for you, is that right? Thank you, Mr. Lu. Sit down. I assume that you have got some important news for me. Well... Oh, my daughter Lu Kuan Lin, a student Lu Tang Kwai. Oh, uh, uh, nice to meet you. Uh, Master Lu has been so kind to me. So I tried my best. 
Ah. This evening, there was a young fellow dressed in white who visited my restaurant. So I thought I'd better come here as soon as I could to tell you about him. Have you found out where this guy's staying? Not yet, but I saw him burn a letter. Master, he's the one. That bastard is responsible for murdering our man. Oh? Well, we can't afford to let him meet with Ye Chu Mao. We'll have to get rid of him. You're right. Let's get rid of him right now. Then Ye Chu Mao will be alone. Dad, I'll go with you, though I might kill him if I can't catch him alive. Are you? Dad, you're always protecting me. But it's such a cruel world. I have to take precautions. What if you should fail? <sighs> Better let Tarquay go. Yes. Uh, I will leave you, Mr. Lou. Better be going. Fine. Miss Chang Cheng, I must say, you're prettier than ever. Really? Of course. <laughs> you look a bit dumb to me, but you talk well enough. <laughs> Brother Lee, when you cross the river, will you be near your home? Yeah. <laughs> 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 You value your life, I think you better get out of here. What's another death to me? I've seen death too many times. You have to get I wonder which of us will die.
sister went out to collect Rosalie, but she should have been back by now. Don't you worry. He'll be back here soon. Grandpa, has your brother Lee Scofo come on along? We'll see if he's coming. Mingar! Grandpa? <laughs> Take a look. See who's there, huh? Well, how is she? Come on, speak up. She... Speak up! She's dead. <laughs> She's dead. Grandpa! Down at the river, I thought with the little young man, Miss Chang Ching followed us on a bamboo raft. It tipped over and she drowned. Where is she? I tried, but I couldn't find her. Grandpa, sister, she <laughs> Ten years ago, my daughter-in-law was murdered by Lu Yan Lu. Who would have guessed that ten years later, he would also murder my only granddaughter? It's all my fault. I should have saved Miss Changjing. <laughs> Get up. Yes, sir. expected her to die before me and I had retired here. The trouble always seems to find me. It's my fault. I'm the one responsible for her drowning. <sighs> How can you say that? It isn't your fault. Nobody is blaming you. I'll avenge her death. I swear I'll make Louie Anlon pay for it. Grandpa, I'll take revenge for sister too. <sighs> You're a kid. You wouldn't even know where to begin, and I don't want you going out trying to be a hero. Grandpa, we can't just forget about it. <sighs> Why do people have to end up killing each other? It only causes further death. My grandpa wrote you a letter, but they wanted to get it, so I destroyed it back at the restaurant. Even so, they still came after me. <sighs> Sit down. Sir. I have always known Lu Yanlong was a greedy man. Since my brother Yen Shehai died, he's not given up on wanting me dead. Grandpa, yeah. we can't stay here waiting for him. I've had to suffer so much. I don't want to talk about it now. Well, what's the news? Uh, he's dead. Oh, who did it? Uh, remember that young man who came to the restaurant? Mm, I knew it had happened. He didn't have any patience. Dead? Serves him right. Uh, hadn't we better inform Master Lou? No. He's bound to send a man here to see me. Mm. Dad, I said to let me go, but you refused. taco has gone two days now, and we had no news yet. Do you think Chin Chu would double-cross me? Take my money and also work for them? Chen, what do you think? Master, if you ask me, he can't be trusted. Chin Chu's a clever fox. 
Money is something he likes too much. He's your man. Dad, you must make a decision. Master, I have an idea. <laughs> Dad. Fine. See that it's done. Yes, sir. What's the secret? What's your plan? My dear, if you needed to know, I'd tell you all about it. Jen, off you go. Yes, sir. Practice harder. Don't be so idle. Oh. Your legs. <laughs> Steady your step more. <laughs> Stomach in oh. and straighten your legs. Oh. Huh? Oh. Standing straight enough. Now, oh. as I say. So easy. Oh. Uh. 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 Mr. Kerr, I'm sorry. Can I help you? Mr. Chu, I don't think so, unless you want to help. Huh? Have you come about Lin Tarkway's death? Right, Mr. Chu. My master said he isn't happy with your work. I don't understand what he's talking about. Hmm. Don't take it personally, if I speak frankly. Go ahead. You betray Lin uh, Me betray Lin Eh? Uh, what should make you think such a thing? Hmm. You've broken our agreement, took our money, and not delivered. It does look bad. Hmm. Sure, sure. But I can tell you that I have searched everywhere, high and low, throughout the county. And it's just as if Yu Chao Mao disappeared from the face of the earth, so that... So that you couldn't find him? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Why pay for information? If the informer is so incapable of supplying it, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. Uh. And you have been sent to punish me. <laughs> Not now. But I'll give you just three more days. If by that time you still haven't found where your Chu Mao is, say your prayers, because you'll be as good as dead. Oh, Brother Kerr, well, I... You shut up. The boss has been kind to you. It's up to you to repay him. Eh? Uh, Brother Kerr... Uh...
Hey. The fact that I bumped into you two here has reminded me of something. Well, that's it's you. What's that? Uh, I really don't know how I should tell you this. <laughs> Master Jew, in just a year, you changed an awful lot, man. Well, uh... Tell me. Don't be scared. I heard talk in town that one of your friends, Lin Tarquay, has been murdered. Oh? <laughs> oh, fighters die sometime. That's nothing. Today you kill, or maybe tomorrow somebody will kill you. You shouldn't say that. Just ain't decent. I thought... Lin Tarquay was your best friend. That's the truth. If we're starving, with no money, what use is friendship? Won't fill your belly. Oh, but you're a famous fighter. You shouldn't say that. Makes me feel scared. Scared? There's not much point in being a fighter nowadays, because as soon as you get beaten, they kill you. Huh? huh? Right, brother. The kind of life we're forced to lead means we only care about things right at this very moment. Huh. Money. Easy. But you'll have to do me a favor. Certainly. Tell me. What is it? A killing. Who is it? You're to kill the man who killed Lin Tarquay. It's him. Do you know him? Certainly. I asked the manager at your restaurant about the guy. Oh, so I'll be depending on you guys. Ah. Uh. Uh. Oh, Master Chu. Money. Money? Yeah, I catch up front or else it's no deal. <laughs> My friend, here's 50 bucks. Take it. Master Chu, only 50? No. Once you've done it, there's a hundred more. Oh, uh, uh, Master Chu, uh, I'll tell you, we did come here to find out what happened to Lin Tark Way. But uh, money, uh, the more the better. Yes, he's right. Yeah. <laughs> See ya. Bye. Uh. You really are top fighters. Miss Chang Ching, today would have been your birthday. Master told me to be patient, but I've been patient too long. Now I'm gonna get revenge for you. You must bless me first. I'm gone now. Jamming, I've just gone outside for a short while. Brother Lee, I want to go to Alka with you. Jamming, you be good, huh? You be a good boy. You stay home. Wait till Grandpa gets back. Goodbye. Uh. At least tell me your names before I kill you. Huh. We're looking for you. And now at last we caught up with you. You've still not told me, but you're trying to kill me. You can't call yourselves real fighters. You brought it on yourself. You've got a price on your head. Are you two from Chinlong Village? We've been looking for you to take revenge for Lindar Quay. Oh? Friend of yours? Shut up! Get him! <laughs> <laughs> Ha! <laughs> 
This guy sure moves fast. Brother, we got him. He'll be dead soon. Uh, let's go. You've got badly hurt. I had to fight them. I'm not a coward. I just couldn't wait any longer. Patience is not a failing. Oh, Yan Long's the man behind it. I have believed in Buddha all my life. He will protect us now. But if I don't take revenge, Miss Chang Ching won't rest until I do. Were those men you fought from Chinlong Village? No. I said they were friends of Lin Oh, the odd boxing style. Master, is that the style of Kung Fu they used to defeat me? Don't fight again. Uh, uh, Master, what's the point in learning Kung Fu? <sighs> Kung Fu strengthens the body and enhances the skills of the mind. You understand? Yes, Master. Practice more. Oh, 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 master, you're hurting me. It hurts. You're hurting me, Master. Please. Take a bath. Uh, uh, Miss, I wasn't watching. You're a liar. If you weren't watching, why were you running away? Hmm? I. Uh, mm? uh, <laughs> I. Uh, I was just passing by and I washed my face. I didn't watch. I didn't look at you. Ah, so you uh, did see me. Because uh, you said you had. But you didn't look. Uh, hmm? Really? I didn't look. <laughs> you didn't? Am I ugly? I'm not very beautiful. Uh, no, no. Uh, no, you're not. You're pretty. <laughs> you're beautiful. <laughs> you're lying. If I wasn't so ugly, you would have looked at me. But you refused to look. Uh, I tell you, I've never met such a nice girl ever before in my life. Do you mean that? When I was a child, Mother said I was ugly. Uh huh? I've no mum, but my master says I'm stupid. Lady, do you think I'm stupid? No, you're not. You're very handsome. Oh. I like being with you. <laughs> if I really was stupid, then master wouldn't take me as his student. But he's always keeping on at me about learning the 18 weapons. Oh, oh, oh well, you know, the low hand fist style. I have learned that one, too. <laughs> 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 What's so funny? Uh, nothing. Up until now, you haven't even told me your name. Oh, Lee Tai. And yours? I won't tell you. Oh, but I told you, so why can't you tell me your name? 
Lu Chang Lin. Oh, I must say you have a very pretty name. Mm, who'd have thought you could be such a sweet talker? Uh, where are you living? Can I come uh, and visit you? Uh, oh, my master wouldn't like that with no visitors. Then perhaps I can meet you again right here. Oh, good idea. Stupid fool. Master! Uh, why are you so slow? Yes, huh? Master. Come on, you must try to give your best. Yeah, you're jumping far too high. You must stand rock still. Hold tight. It's the way to learn Kung Fu. Now, come on. <laughs> Miss Lin, is your home at Tung Chang? I've got no home. My dad, my mom, both abandoned me. I don't know where either of them is now. Whereabouts have you been staying? <laughs> you wouldn't know. I sleep in hedgerows or ruined temples, any place I find. What do you eat? <laughs> no wonder your master says you're dumb. The cost of dumpling is 10 cents. I got half left. Here, go and have some more. I couldn't. You need it for yourself. Come on. Why do you have to be so stupid? I'm not going to starve to death. Eat some. Uh. <laughs> Are you afraid that there's some poison in it? No, no. Please, don't get me wrong. But I can't help feeling sorry for you. You are very sweet. I like you. But why can't your master take me on? I can do all the cooking and laundry. Uh, master would never agree to it. <laughs> Tell me, what is your master called? Oh, he's... Uh... Yeah, Chu Mao. Oh, then I'll visit him tomorrow. Uh, Miss Lin, you can't visit. My master, he hates all visitors. <laughs> really, you can't <laughs> visit me. <laughs> Miss Lin! <Lynn. laughs> Your father wants you. Hmm. What does he want me for now? I've done nothing. I, I didn't mean that. Your father was worried about you when he couldn't find you, that's all. That's all right. I was out searching. <laughs> but uh, don't you realize you're no good alone? You two just stay home all day waiting for choose news. But he's always fixing things to suit him. Wait, I can be of great help. Oh, Miss Lin, if you say you've been searching, do you have any good news? <laughs> I can't talk about it. Let's be getting home now.
it. I've had it. You've had it. And you've practiced the whole night, too. Oh, not again. Young man, if you want to learn, you must practice hard. Sir. Now practice. Sir. to do that. you move. You keep perfectly still. You need to strengthen your legs. Young man, don't give up now. Uh, gentlemen, we can talk it over. Uh, gentlemen, wait for me. Wait for me. Uh, let me explain it to you. Gentlemen, we can talk it over. Hey, there's nothing more to say. Didn't you say we got rid of that guy for you? He pays a hundred more. Well, that's right. Uh, you broke your word. You lied. Uh, you can't say that to me. If that bastard is still alive, of course I won't pay. What's that? He's alive? But this evening, he will be coming to a restaurant with an old fisherman. If you two can ambush him on his way, I'll pay you your money. He'll keep you away. It's a deal. Brother, hadn't we better take the money first? My friend, you ought to know that my credit is good. Ask anyone around here. Here. Mister, I'll be perfectly honest with you. If we didn't think we could do this job, we would never take your money. Mm. Good. Then it's a deal. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, mister, here, drink. <laughs> mister, we ought to enjoy ourselves now. Come on, let's drink up. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, so we should enjoy ourselves. Why don't we get drunk together tonight? Oh, we're feeling kind of good, but how come you're so depressed, huh? Ah, mister, you don't understand. There have been so many people around inquiring after Lee Tai recently. Oh? There's been so much fighting that people have been killed every day. Who gives a damn? It's... None of our business. We stay out of it. Oh, come on, let's drink up. Oh. Mm. The wailing of the ghost crying in the night makes the brave warriors clutch at their sword. Oh, oh. mister. You know poetry as well, then. Uh, I'm old now. I know a bit, but only little bits. Ah, don't be so modest. Huh. Mm. Mm. Huh. A well-aimed spear wins the day. The short one, the lethal one, the short sword pitted against the axe. Those belong to the 18 weapons. Oh. Here, come, let's drink. Huh. Cheers. I wonder, would he be your Chu Mao? Hm. You aren't any use, so you won't need to be paid.
to a young woman the other day. Who is she? Hush. Huh? She's a poor girl with no home. You mustn't tell Grandpa. You must be careful. Grandpa gets so nervous about strangers. Has he found her? Not yet. But did you spend the night with that young woman I saw with? Hey, I did. I'm with Grandpa to the restaurant. Check about Louie and Lang. Oh, that man with the mustache is bad. I don't like him. Oh, I agree. He's on our way back home. Two, two fellows were following us. Oh, who are they? Same two guys I met before. What did you do to them? Well, Grandpa told me to stay behind. Use the 18 weapon style to defeat them. But beat both of them. Wow, Brother Lee, you're great. Hmm. Hey, if you have another fight, take me along too. All right. You gotta practice kung fu first. Hmm. We found both their bodies on Tung Chang Mountain today. Jin Chu mentioned a fisherman to me. That's right. I remember Miss Lin mentioned a fisherman to me too. He must be Yer Chu Mao. Oh. Yer Chu Mao. We've spent years looking for him, and so many of our men have been killed. But if we can get rid of this old man once and for all, <laughs> then I will be the champion fighter. Hmm. Master, let's move on him right away. Don't let's waste any more time. Right, but you be careful. I'll be along shortly. <laughs> It is valuable, belonging to all of us. But so many crooks have tried to get it. But Ali, what is written inside it? Oh, it's how to use the 18 weapons. Oh. Brother Lee, do you think you could show it to me? All right. Till you're grown up. Your turn to practice. Right. Dead? Dead. 
must go. My dear, all right, but listen to me. You are my one and only daughter. No, Dad, I can't let you die. I won't die. Your Jew Mao isn't good enough to beat me. Dad, I must go with you. Lena! I must go! Lena! Lena! <laughs> Dad! <laughs> What do you want? I want you to hand over the book on the 18 weapons. Give me the book. <laughs> Don't play tough. You are no match for me. spared your life after you murdered my brother. I made a mistake ten years ago. It's not ten years later, and soon you're gonna join your brother.
a child. You're an animal. You're just in time. Now hand over the 18 weapons training manual. I'll kill you! Oh, hey, hey, oh. 
For killing, we should let him lead a new life. Come on, let's go. Uh, 